As a business owner, you're very aware of how important it is to be able to run transactions and accept payments. It is quite literally the foundation of any business. And as a gas station owner, you're even more aware of how important it is to have an effective POS system. Gas station customers expect fast and reliable service and you can meet this demand through BitPost point of sale system. Having your POS solution truly can help you manage your sales more effectively. Now using back office for your gas station business, I already inputted the gasoline in the items of back office so I will just show you sales pricing and item adjustments. So click items and inventory and then click sales pricing to see all of the gasoline. So now for example premium, let's change the price, retail and change the price. And click add new. Now as you can see we have new price added. So for our next gasoline, for example diesel, and add new. As you can see we have new price added. So now we can now proceed to inventory adjustments. For example, again, premium and input stock inventory here. And then the unit cost. And click add item. Next, diesel. Input the quantity per liter. And add item. Now click process adjustment to process the adjustments. And now that we're done, we can now proceed to reports. Inventory and click stock movement report. Filter the category. And here as you can see, we have premium and with the inward stocks. Also with the diesel and the remaining balance. Now for our pump monitor for our gasoline station business, open the pump monitoring and as you can see, this is the interface for our pump monitoring. So for example, the pump attendant inputted 1 liter of premium gasoline here in our number 3 nozzle. It will automatically fetch a sales order number or our SO number. The sales order is the pending transaction or the transaction that hasn't been paid yet, while our tendered sales is the SO or the sales order number that is already paid and done. So this is just the simulated nozzle since we don't have the literal pump here. The cashier will fetch the sales order number to proceed with tendering. Now for our cashiering, the cashier will just fetch the SO number so for example, we have here sales order 104 and proceed to the cashiering, click SO or sales order and input the sales order number. And as you can see, we have here the premium gasoline, proceed to tender sales, input the payment amount and click tender sales. Now, the receipt printer will print and the cash drawer will open. Now, optimize your business to its true potential with BitPost point of sale system. If you have further questions or concerns, you can message us on Facebook or call us on your company number. Now guys, if you want to boost your business, choose BitPost.